Hello, 127th Wing. I'm General Mammon, and welcome to the April Drill. Today we're filming for munitions. I want to tell you how critical munitions is to the 127th Wing and its projection of combat power. Uh, some of the things that they do here is track every piece of munition that the 127th Wing uses. That's not just for the aircraft. They track everything from a 9mm bullet that our defenders will use, all the way up to a 2,000 pound precision guided munition like the one you see behind us here. Typically, anytime we do any kind of deployment or exercise, uh, munitions is usually the first in and the last out. They usually show up to the location about a week prior to get things set up to build the, uh, the bombs as necessary to uh, be successful during the exercise, and they're the last out, tearing everything down and cleaning up uh, before they come home. So today I'm here to recognize Sergeant Van Haverbeck for all the work he's been doing for the 127th Wing. Most recently, he was with the team that traveled to Volkfield, Wisconsin, where we're working on a new innovative uh, capability for the A-10. That is the miniature air launch decoy, or the MALD. It's a new thing that the A-10s uh, can be doing that we can present uh, for our combatant commanders. So with that, I want to thank you for all the work that you're doing, appreciate it, and thanks for everything you do for the 127th Wing. Now for a quick COVID update. The 127th Wing is still in uh, health protection condition Bravo. Our community transmission level of COVID-19 is low, so what does that mean for all of us? That means no one is required to wear masks. Again, that is voluntary. If you wish to wear a mask, you can, but it's not a requirement anymore. And because we are in a low infection area, uh, weekly testing is no longer required. We are closely monitoring the uh, new Omicron variant that is spreading throughout the community. As of right now, again, our community levels are low, but uh, again, we ask for everybody's flexibility in case we have to change posture. But please remember, if you're not feeling well, please do not show up to work. Please stay home and get tested. All right, some things to consider for this April drill. Remember, looking forward, we're going to be doing a contested generation in May in both the KC-135s and the A-10s. So this drill, the April drill, is your last opportunity to make sure that you're ready to do that. So what does that look like when we don't have power or we don't have computer access and we have to generate aircraft? So those are some of the things that you need to consider and think about this drill to be ready for the May drill. Now I'd just like to remind everybody about our air show and open house in July. Hot off the presses this week, we've expanded our show. So uh, as you remember, we do have the F-22 demo for uh, the air show. But now we also have the Canadian CF-18 uh, demo and the Air Force C-17 demo and the Army Golden Knights. The show should be fantastic. Again, remember, it's 9 and 10 uh, July, and I'm looking forward to seeing everybody there for the air show and open house. This month is the month of the Guard family. And as you recall, when we talked about culture uh, several months ago, the one word that was used the most, how you want the culture to be described in the 127th wing, is family. So I ask you to think about that and reach out to your wingman. See how your buddy is doing. Make sure that we are truly being a family here in the 127th wing. It is our goal to be the best led, most efficient, effective, and adaptable organization in the United States Air Force. I appreciate your leadership and I appreciate your professionalism.